340 dogs are now in Hillsborough County's custody, removed from unfit living conditions at a Tampa dog breeder. It on your side's Victoria Price has done some digging into this case tonight, and she joins us now live. Victoria. Yeah, Jen, this is one of the largest cases that Hillsborough County has ever handled, but turns out it's not the first time this dog breeder has wound up in the dog house. It could take days to inspect, treat, and remove all 340 dogs from Trisha's All Breed Grooming, also known as Toyland Pet Resort. I've seen dental disease, skin issues, um, eye infection. Hillsborough County began seizing the dogs Monday after a court order effectively shut the breeder down. Pet Resources described the dogs living in overcrowded, deplorable conditions with not enough staff to take care of them. One puppy already dead when the county arrived. And you might see as many as 20 or 30 dogs in a cage that probably should only have one or two. The court order comes after the county says it received several complaints from potential dog buyers. It bans the business owner, Robert Royers, from owning pets in Hillsborough County. Aid on your side found it's not the first time he's had dogs seized from that property. In 2011, a judge removed Royer's dogs from the East Diana Street facility, a court order that included Alice Holt. County records show Holt owns the property. Holt has also been banned from owning dogs in Hillsborough County since 2011. That we've had dealings with them as much as 20 years ago. That's when more than 450 dogs were seized from the property, according to more court documents we found, raising serious questions about how this apparent puppy mill carried on for so long. Now, because taking in these animals effectively doubled how many the county had in their custody, they're waiving adoption fees in the hopes of making a little more room. Reporting live in Hillsborough County, Victoria Price, 8 on your side.